Welcome back to Sales Insights with Sarah. This is the podcast for sales professionals and business leaders looking to implement new strategies and drive sales growth in their organizations. I'm your host, Sarah Downs, and my guests and I will be sharing with you some of our own experiences in business and sales insights to help you gain focus and take action. Hi everyone and welcome back to the Sales Insights with Sarah podcast. So today I'm going to be talking about building your personal brand. Now this is something that I'm really passionate about. It's definitely something that's helped me a lot over the years. But this morning I was just looking through my LinkedIn feed and really starting to see that I guess imbalance of personal brand versus corporate brand shining through. So what I would say is that personal brands are built by are not built sorry by resharing the company blog or the company content a couple of times a week. They're built by being you. People want to see the person behind the brand. They want to hear your stories, they want to learn from your own knowledge, they want to follow a journey. They want to understand your challenges. They want to see what works for you. And therefore, by being vulnerable and sharing some of those challenges, but also the solutions can work really well. You've heard it time and time again, people buy from people. So please show them you, not your company. And it's not about being an expert. It's not about sharing just for the sake of sharing. It's about allowing people to get to know you. They want to know you better. They want to know about your life. They want to know about your career. They want to know you. It's about sharing the content that you feel passionate about. Something that's going to show them what you care about and something that they might care about too. And therefore, you will get that connection. It's about showing up and being consistent. But it's not all about how many followers you have and how many likes you have, how many comments you have. And people get so wrapped up in that. Of course, they're great, you know, signs and a gauge of how well content's doing. But you could get great views sometimes on the corporate stuff or sharing news, but it's not going to make people buy from you. It's not going to make people want to get to know you necessarily. Some of my friends and business have hundreds of thousands of followers, some of them even in the millions, but they will only do business with a very small percentage. Now, the guys that have the great personal brand and share their stories, share what's working, share the insight that their followers want to hear, they're the ones that convert. So yes, personal brands help salespeople to sell, but they also help people to get jobs. They help people to get promotion. And they help you meet people, great people, that could be those relationships that last a lifetime. I've connected with people from all around the world through my personal brand. People that I've done business with, people that I've visited when I've been traveling on business, people that I now know about their family, you know, their children, where they go on vacation. And Those are the relationships that matter. But it all starts with you. So give it a try. Try sharing your story. Try sharing that journey that you're on. Speak about business. Speak about life. Speak about what you're passionate about, what you care about, what interests you. The hardest part will always be at the start, as with anything. But I know that you have value to give. I know that people do want to hear from you. You just need to figure out what that value is. Figure out what you can provide to others. Don't focus on selling. Don't focus on sharing a business message. Just spend a couple of minutes even, a day to start with, focusing on that personal brand. Invest your time, invest your energy. And once you start to see the results, you'll start spending more time, I hope. And honestly, it might be the best investment you ever make. So it's a short one for me today, but I think it's really important. It's something I'm super passionate about and I just wanted to share it with you guys. Thanks for listening. Thank you for listening to the Sales Insights with Sarah podcast. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already 
so that you are notified of every new episode. If you could take a few minutes to leave a review, it would be greatly appreciated. See you next time.